Have you ever wanted to talk with your headlamp? Well, now for the first time, you can. Coast on. I'm one of the first people in the world to have received the Coast RL35R. This voice activated headlamp will follow quite a few commands and allow you to control it without your hands. Uh, in this video, I'm gonna walk you through a few of the modes that you can use and some of the voice commands and give you a few impressions of what I've found using it so far. Let's jump into it. It has 1100 lumens max output, medium power with its flood on high. It kicks out 500 lumens for about six and a half hours. These are really good, not outstanding, but solid specs for the headlamp industry. It kicks out red, blue, or green light. It has a spotlight, a floodlight, and what it calls the arc system, which is a 280 degree light uh, that really casts a nice, soft, warm light at close range. What really stands out about this headlamp is the voice control. Coast on. You can see that without touching that, I could easily go to the on mode. But there are a lot more things that I can do too. Coast, arc. Now, I have a very warm, even light for close range work. Coast, flood. As you can see, this is gonna offer me a medium range flood light. With it in its spot range, spot mode, it has a range of about 155 meters. You can see that's a nice narrow beam and uh, eliminates a good distance. But it does a lot more too. So I can control the power of the light, coast down. And now I can turn it up, coast up, coast up. Now it's kicking out much more light. You can also go directly to other lighting modes. Coast red. Coast green. Coast blue. Finally, I can jump right to high and low power modes. Coast maximum. That's gonna give me all light at once because I'm combined spotlight and floodlight. So you get a nice powerful center lighting with a uh, ring light around it. And coast minimum. That's gonna turn it down to its lower, lowest power setting in the white light. So a few impressions on this light. It's worth noting that this light has a tail light. This is both optional and um, pretty useful for anyone who's either cycling or running on roads. So it's got a tail light here that operates separately, does not use voice activation. Next, this light has an on and off feature. So on the bottom of the light, there's a button that you press once. That turns the light off or on, so it will not respond to voice activation now. Voice, uh, for example, coast on, coast off. Now, touch that button, coast on, and it works. Coast off. I have found overall that the light works very well. It does have buttons on the top so you can control it like a traditional headlamp. These different buttons, you know, move through the different modes. It is not programmed to your voice alone. So generally it will work on anyone's voice. So if someone else starts uh, deciding they're gonna play with you, they can tell you coast on, coast off, or change the color of your light to whatever they feel like. Who is this for? I can see the utility of this light for anyone who has mobility issues or is unable to use their hands for whatever reason. That could range from you know, wearing incredibly heavy gloves or being in an industrial setting or somewhere else that you have to have your hands occupied all the time, um, or just that you cannot use them. Will it change headlamp use for everyone? I don't think so. Many people, like for myself, most of the time I have no issue whatsoever reaching up, pressing a button on the headlamp, and changing it to whatever power or mode I need. That said, it is a nice functional element. It works well. Um, it's simple and sometimes it can be simpler than trying to scroll through a complicated headlamp setting. Overall, this is a very unique, very different type of headlamp coming to market. 
I'm really excited to see what people do with it and how it affects the future of lighting. It's the first time I've ever seen this kind of headlamp or this functionality on a lighting source. Coast on. If you want to be able to use something like this in a headlamp, coast red. Or be able to scroll through color settings and powers while at camp, coast arc. Well, now you can. Coast off. Till next time, I'm Sean McCoy. Check out the link below and read about the full review on gearjunkie.com. Coast off.